Welcome to the Open3D Engine YouTube channel. I'm Alex DeMargin, a technical trainer with the AWS Game Tech team. So maybe you heard some buzz about the open source project O3DE, and this left you with a few unanswered questions. Well, look no further. In this video, we're going to take a look at what exactly the Open3D Engine is and at some of its many features. Now, a quick disclaimer before we begin. Due to the open source nature of O3DE, the O3DE community is constantly making improvements. So check the description below for any updates. So what exactly is O3D? It's a multi-platform 3D development engine that brings together both integrated and external 3D authoring tools like Maya, Blender, ZBrush, The Substance Suite, and countless others. This enables users to build AAA games, cinema quality 3D worlds for video production, and high fidelity simulations. Another incredible benefit of using O3DE is that the user pays zero licensing fees. Open3D Engine consists of a robust set of features, for instance, gems, which are modules that contain libraries with standard interfaces and assets. Each system in O3DE is provided by its own gem and you can pick and choose what functionality to add based on your requirements. You can also customize O3DE or replace functionality entirely with your own gems. In future videos, we'll cover gems in much more depth. Another incredible feature is Atom, O3DE's physically based renderer. Atom is a cross-platform, modular, data-driven, and multi-threaded renderer that can be extended for a wide variety of visual and performance needs. Some of Atom's features include support for forward and deferred rendering, modular framework that allows for multiple rendering paths, DirectX 12, Vulkan, and Metal Graphics API support. It's optimized for cluster forward and shading models with discrete passes that give you control over Atom's final output, global illumination, ray tracing, support for parallax correction, and the Amazon shader language, a flexible extension of HLSL that allows you to write your own shaders in a familiar syntax. Overall, there's no limitations on customizable render passes. In O3DE, you can create runtime logic and functionality visually with Script Canvas or Program with Lua. With Script Canvas, scripts are created as flow graphs by placing and connecting functionality nodes in a visual editor. No programming required. Script Canvas allows you to experiment and iterate quickly and provides an easy entry point to new developers. With Lua, O3DE provides a traditional script model and the ability to use the editor of your choice. You don't have to choose one or the other. You can use both Script Canvas and Lua in your projects and even within scripted entities. O3DE provides support for a suite of industry standard physics solutions that you can use to add realism to your actors and environments and to visualize simulations, O3D provides support for the following simulation SDKs. NVIDIA PhysX for creating static and dynamic rigid bodies, dynamic joints, and forces such as wind and gravity. NVIDIA Cloth, creating clothing and fabrics that realistically react to animated entities and physical forces. NVIDIA Blast for creating dynamic destruction and multiple layers of fracturing and user-defined vector and stress damage limits. These physics solutions can be added as attributes to simple or complex entities. These entities can be created, shared, reused, and dynamically spawned with O3DE's prefab system. O3DE's prefab system includes the following features. Reusable assets with complete properties, components, and hierarchies. Prefabs use a human readable text format, so you can use standard source control tools to view diffs and merge changes. Prefabs can be placed and managed dynamically as spawnables. Accompanying prefabs is another exciting tool that will allow you to build levels quickly. With O3DE's Whitebox gem, you can sculpt and manipulate geometric volumes quickly to get your world sketched out in Engine. This will allow you to build both finalized assets as well as rapidly prototype entire worlds for your team. These are just some of the features O3DE offers. So stay tuned for future videos where we're going to explore much more O3D related content. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.